Many families, COVID-19 canceled summer vacations. Instead, your family could take a day trip to one of many unique places here in North Carolina. Shannon Smith joins us live from Greensboro for our vacation destination series this morning. Where are you taking us, Shannon? Good morning, Cindy. All you need to do is fill up your car with one tank of gas. You can head down to the Carolina Tiger Rescue. It's in Pittsburgh and Chatham County. You'll feel like, though, that you're in the middle of a jungle standing feet from lions and tigers. All right, so first thing we have to do. Summer campers at Carolina Tiger Rescue watch these big cats create Paul Cossos. And the tigers and other cats really love to just roll in that paint and sniff it and feel it and lick it. And, you know, that's just one of the ways that we keep them happy and healthy, um, physically and mentally stimulated. <laughs> 50 animals live at the sanctuary and not just tigers. They also house leopards and lions, caracals and cougars, all rescued from people or organizations that could no longer care for them. Like Raja, an off-duty police officer in North Carolina found the tiger abandoned. He was found along the side of a road outside of Charlotte with his sister Kayla. They were about six months old. They were just walking down the side of a road. Fan favorite Elvis Serval just showed up in a cat cage at the sanctuary one day. He's a small cat, but he is so feisty and so um, engaging. His story, I think, is what really makes people uh, love him. He was actually a family pet and the family surrendered him to Carolina Tiger Rescue. Other animals came from traveling zoos or circuses. All the animals now enjoy a life of leisure and sometimes laughs Roger. at the rescue. So you can be guaranteed that we're taking excellent care of these animals and the experience that you're going to have out here with your family is one of education as well as amazement. <laughs> Tour guides take visitors on an hour and a half walk through the sanctuary, sharing the stories of the animals and educating them about their plight in the wild and captivity. One, they come out, they experience experience seeing a tiger or a lion um, kind of up close, they get that experience, but at a safe distance, that's safe for the animals. Um, at the same time, they're learning about, learning about that species, why it's important to protect them. And it's that up close experience, like standing just a few feet from two lions, that makes a lasting impression. People really form dynamic attachments to the animals and it changes their lives. The Carolina Tiger Rescue is again located in Chatham County near Pittsburgh and they do make online reservations for tickets right now because they are limiting the size of their tour groups to be safe because of COVID-19. So you need to buy those ahead of time. Public tours happen during the weekends, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Private tours all throughout the week and they do have special twilight tours as well. The animals tend to be more active and it's not as hot, so that might be something you want to do instead, Cindy.